Hey guys, what's going on? It's Jeff, the horror file 666. Uh, this is going to be a quick uh, Blu-ray update. I went to my local FYE today, basically the only one that's still open in my area, and uh, um, I was watching someone's video on YouTube, and they mentioned there was a sale at FYE. If you buy virtually anything in the store, you could get a brand new copy of Halloween on Blu-ray for $6.99. Uh, it's normally worth $19.99 brand new. So that's why I headed on over there. Um, I had eight DVDs that I was interested in, you know, trading in for some store credit. And uh, after I got my store credit, I was looking around, and I was going to pick up uh, The Hills Have Eyes Part 2 Unrated, you know, the remake. And um, something else just caught my eye, and I saw a sign that says, you buy any two used items in the store, be it uh, CDs, DVDs, Blu-rays, and uh, you can get the third one for one dollar only. So, yeah, so I definitely took advantage of that. I didn't really want to spend very much money. You know, I was only thinking maybe, you know, ballpark figure around $20. I ended up getting almost 15 for my trade-in, so, you know, it wasn't really like I had to put so much towards it. But anyway, yeah, so I asked one of the store associates. I said, oh, uh, it looks like you guys are seem to be out of the uh, Halloween DVD. Not DVD, Halloween Blu-ray. And he's like, oh, yeah, we only have the DVD in right now. And it's just like the the way that he said it to me was just so nonchalant, like he could have gave a crap less. So I didn't really want to take his word for it. And I ended up asking another store associate, and then first they got it confused that I was interested in the DVD. And then I'm like, no, I want the Blu-ray. You know, I said, that's the main reason why I'm here, because of the sale. And then he's like, oh, we just got a truck in, um, you know, yesterday evening, and I'll go check. There was a bunch of stock that wasn't out yet. And then he goes in the back, a couple minutes later, he comes out, and he's got like a whole armful of the Blu-rays. And he said, yeah, they had ordered 15 for this sale. And then, like, after they're out of the 15, that's it. So there's no such thing as a rain check or whatever. And, um, yeah, so I ended up, you know, snagging one. I had to do a little bit of, uh, you know, leg work and, you know, some haggling to kind of, you know, get them in the back and take a look at it. But I was really appreciative of that. So, yeah, so I picked up Halloween on Blu-ray, and uh, I don't know, you know, how good it looks. I have not seen the quality yet, but uh, they had, like, another little sticker thing over that, so that way when they price it, it doesn't come up $19.99. Um, actually, it was ringing up $7.99, but no, the sales were $6.99, so I told them that, too. I said, you know, I want it for $6.99. That's why I came here, and, yeah, so there we go. Uh, the buy two, get one for a dollar thing, um, this was the one... Uh, that I ended up getting for a dollar. It's a digital copy special edition, Kiefer Sutherland and Mirrors Unrated. This has um, an alternate ending, um, a number of special features. Basically, it's a DVD, Blu-ray, digital copy. And, um, you know, upon inspecting it, I didn't think all the stuff was going to be in there. But, yeah, there's the Blu-ray, there's the, you know, thing for the digital copy, and then there's the DVD. So, yeah, I mean, I was surprised to get that. Uh, this was uh, $5.94, but I ended up getting it for $1 because of the deal. And then I picked up uh, a double feature of Gamera. Uh, it's Gamera, Guardian of the Universe, and Gamera 2, Attack of the Legend. Uh, this is put out by uh, Mill Creek, but, I mean, you know, it's it's okay. You know, you're talking like uh, some 1960s... Uh, sort of, you know, Godzilla rip-off sort of thing, and uh, Gamera is basically like this big turtle monster thing, and, uh, you know, it's got sci-fi creature feature monster stuff happening, and, you know, it wasn't bad. This was five ninety nine used. And then finally I picked this up, uh, Resident Evil Degeneration, an original CGI motion picture. Um, the only, I mean, I like Resident Evil sort of, but, like, the main thing that caught my eye on this was the zombies and stuff. And, uh, you know, you see them on the back there. I mean, this is pretty closely translated to the video game. Um, I've owned this twice now on DVD. Sold it both times. And then, you know, I only really got about 15 minutes into it max on DVD. But I figured, well, I'll give it a shot. Because there was only just a handful of things that were you know, horror, science fiction related, and, uh, you know, I plan on getting the rest of the Resident Evil stuff on Blu-ray, and being the completist that I am, I figured, well, I'll need this anyway, so let me grab it. So, yeah, so that's what I got today. Um, uh, basically, the grand total came out to uh, $6.94, so 
it's pretty much like I only paid for you know uh, Halloween and I got the other stuff as a fair trade so yeah Resident Evil Degeneration uh, Gamera uh, two movies on one disc Mirrors Unrated and John Carpenter's Halloween um, yeah also guys if you haven't checked it out yet I did a uh, shout out video to uh, Tim Dax uh, you know he's becoming a pretty good friend here of mine online um, he's been doing some work with Trauma uh, he has a feature film coming out called Mr. Bricks. Uh, it's a horror uh, horror movie musical, basically. Um, you know, it's it's a little bit hard to explain, but it looks very cool. If you check out on the Trauma site or type in um, you know Mr. Bricks in the description, and you'll you'll be able to see it. Uh, yeah, it looks really cool. Um, he's he's a very talented guy and everything, and uh, you know just making double sure because this will probably be posted after that. So if you have not seen it, please, please, please check it out. You know, it would mean a lot to me if you go over there and uh, take a look at his channel and stuff. And, yeah, so that's about it for now. You know, I usually won't do, like, a Blu-ray update unless I have, like, usually five or more titles. But, you know, I mean, getting Halloween today for that price to me was sort of a big deal. So, um, yeah, just a word to the wise, if you do have any FYEs or anything around, they're doing, like I said, the buy two, get one. Uh, for a dollar, so it's like you buy two things at full price. Um, they have to be used though, and then you get the third used item for one dollar. I'm not sure how long that's running for. I had no clue even till I stepped foot in the door today. The only thing I knew about was this: the uh, Halloween um, on Blu-ray for six ninety-nine. I think I've seen it the lowest about ten or eleven ninety-nine, but then you got to factor in shipping and everything. So I did well today. Um, and then too, you know, if you really want to go in there and basically just get that you know buy like a pack of gum or whatever you know something for like under a dollar or you know, like a real cheap uh, used DVD or something and there you go I mean from a little over eight dollars out the door there you go so yeah that's my update for right now and uh, have an excellent weekend everybody uh, you know things have you know really kinda hit a high point for me and uh, I'm very excited about that so you know be be looking out for future videos and I'll be keeping in touch with everybody Alright, have a great evening. Take care.